let's uh, discuss overhead variances here overhead variances adula nama rendu part ah perikalam one is variable overhead variance variable overhead variance another one is fixed overhead variances inda rendu variances pathi nama paakalam clear now my focus is to make you understand this variable overhead variances nama evlo overheads spend pannu nu nanachom adu rendu evlo vary avudhu is it favorable or not okay when it comes for the variable overhead variances this will be similar to similar to labor variances madri irukum this is similar to labor variances is that okay labor variances labor variances epdi panuvinga labor cost variance is equal to standard hours into standard rate minus actual hours into actual rate cost variance perad labor rate variance per hour evlo kudukrom adha vechi calculate pandrathu labor rate variance standard rate minus actual rate multiplied by actual hours and uh, the next one being labor efficiency variance this is all about consumption of time consumption of time labor efficiency variance varumbodu evlo hours na ungalku sonne evlo hours la mudichinga if you are able to finish off ahead of the time you are more efficient else you will be treated as less efficient into standard rate per hour illaya so epdi kandupidipo standard standard actual okay standard and actual evlo hours save padudhu appi sonaka 10 hours save padudhu and uh, rate per hour rate per hour being 100 nu chekkunga but actually undi ninga 11 hours consume panni irukkeenga rate per hour being 105 105 so you know that the hours consumption is also higher and the payment per hour is also higher definitely both will be your adverse in scenario otherwise the total being 10000 is expected for the output but actual being 105 into 11 1155 am i right 1155 you spend 155 extra which is the adverse here which is the adverse similarly when it comes for the hours 1 hour extra you are spending as per your uh, standard rate uh, sorry 1 hour extra you are spending okay as per the standard rate we pay 100 rupees extra am i right and the rupees extra if you are paying extra 100 then it is an adverse similarly when it comes for the payment being excess than the standard also adverse and the five excess are you know you need to pay panirpinga 11 hours ku pay panirukringa appina 55 adverse if you add up these two you will get this one isn't it clear idha da standard hours into standard rate minus actual hours and actual rate la neenga potu irukringa standard hours varumbodu 10 hours standard rate vandu 100 minus actual hours being 11 hours and actual rate being 105 the difference between these two being 155 adverse and when it comes for the labor rate variance standard rate per hour being 100 but actually we paid 105 as you pay excess then it's always adverse that excess payment is on how many hours means 
the actual hours of 11. So, 11 into 5, 55 adverts, 55 adverts. Labor efficiency variance are both standard hours being 10 and actual hours being 11. We thought we can finish it off by 10 hours, but we consumed 11. You consumed 1 hour extra. Where it cost us me 100 as per my standard rate. 100 rupees adverse. You know that if you add up these two labor rate variance and efficiency variance, you get the labor cost variance. So, get it. When it comes for the variable overhead variances, it is very simple. It is very simple. Okay. Now, standard rate you know, rather than standard rate, you can take, you can take standard variable overhead. This is nothing but variable cost per unit per hour, no. Rather than that, variable overhead per hour, that is how you can change. How that? Yengala standard rate ruko, angala standard variable overhead. Yengala actual rate ruko, angala actual variable overhead per hour, which you put in a sum. Labor cost variance madri inge na varadana. Variable overhead cost variances. Variable overhead cost variances. Okay. So, the formula being standard hours at the upper standard rate badala standard variable overhead per hour aha namakurukum minus actual hours multiplied with the actual rate badala actual variable overhead per hour. That is all. The formula will be the slight variation standard rate badala variable overhead na metta. Labor rate variance is equal to rate and the rate. Variable overhead is rate and the expenses are equal variable expenses. That is variable overhead expenses variance is equal to the name. Here the standard rate being standard rate being 100. The, here, okay, the formula is the standard rate. Are the standard variable overhead per hour minus actual variable overhead per hour multiplied by actual hours. You know the formula values are being the same. So, you can substitute and you will get it. Labor efficiency variance mother in here. Variable overhead efficiency variance are bigger among your portal. Variable overhead efficiency. Efficiency additionally you mind line or no. So, if you have an effective earlier, you can be more efficient. That is why you consume less efficient. That is why you consider consume it, you will be doing in an efficient manner. Standard hearts are 10 hours. Sorry, standard hearts are 10 hours. So, standard hearts minus actual hearts multiplied by standard rate. You can get standard variable over it per hour. Values are the same. That's how you can get the uh, variable overhead variances. If you spend any spend, normal labor variances, the topic over. Is that clear?